lungs, affecting millions of Americans. This patient education module will help you better understand its causes, symptoms, and treatment options. Anatomy Oxygen is vital for life. Without it, death occurs very rapidly. The lungs allow us to fill our blood with oxygen. The air we breathe comes in close contact with the blood in the depth of the lungs. The blood then fills up with oxygen and releases unwanted carbon dioxide, or CO2. When we breathe, the air goes through the mouth and nose. From there, it goes to the air pipe, known as the trachea. From the trachea, it goes into an increasing number of smaller tubes called bronchial tubes. Small, balloon-like sacs called alveoli are at the end of the tubes. The walls of the alveoli are very thin. On the other side of the walls, there are small blood vessels. The very thin wall of the alveoli allows the oxygen to go into the bloodstream and also allows CO2 to go from the blood to your lungs to be exhaled. Muscles surround the bigger bronchial tubes. The inner lining of these bronchial tubes secretes special substances called mucus. The mucus helps trap dirt from the air. Mucus is continuously expelled from the lungs. Very small brushes, known as cilia, on the outside of the lung cells continuously push the mucus to the outside. If the mucus becomes significantly big, it is coughed out. Symptoms and the